I'm Nate, this is Shoot for Productions, and uh, if you haven't been to our channel before, welcome, and if you're a subscriber, welcome back. Uh, just a quick little video today on uh, some ideas to recycle and reuse your empty CO2 canisters. Um, I always think that's a bit of a waste chucking that away. Um, I did have some set up on a range of a hole drilled in a bit of wood and stuck them in, but they didn't knock over, so I'll come up with a 3D printed uh, solution to that problem. If you're interested, keep watching. <laughs> If you watch our channel before you know we do bits and pieces we've done 3d printing um sort of customization and bits and pieces for guns um don't want to mention that really because youtube don't like it so um i'll just stick to this um co2 cartridge thing so what i've come up with is these two uh, little holders i've got magnets in now these are prototypes and uh, the finished product you're not going to be able to see the magnet and what happened is the idea was you glue the magnets in from the back and I had a little thin layer of plastic, but the holes weren't bloody big enough, so I had to drill them through and because that popped right through. So I just glued them in to show you um, the idea of it. Now this is a, um, a vertical mounted one, so you'll mount it on a surface. So you'll mount it on a surface that way, and we are going to put these on our range a bit later. And what you do, you stick your empty seal two cartridges on there, and uh, you shoot them. Ping, they fall off. Uh, easy to reset. If you want to really uh, test your shooting, you could uh, sort of bring them down, experiment different heights. If you gun them powerful enough, the higher you have them, the more leverage that'll have to knock them over. Um, and yeah, I just think easy, simple, quick. Um, these don't even get dented by even a powerful 2.2 rifle. They're so strong. I say, I seem such a shame to chuck them away. So uh, that's the uh, vertical, yeah, vertically mounted one. Um, and this is a horizontal mounted one again the prototype the finished product wouldn't have these magnets showing through that'd just be plain plastic uh, i might even do a little cover on the back just to hide the magnets up and this one sits on a horizontal service and uh you just stand your stand your things in now it's going to be screwed down shoot them pop fall over um if you got i don't know say a bb gun uh, a weak powered uh, gun that ain't knocking them over. You can even stand them up on the thin end and uh, depending on where you hit them again these magnets aren't quite level because uh, they're all drilled through. Yeah, so stand them up on the thin end and that just takes the slightest amount of pressure. Uh, hopefully the wind won't blow them over but if it does, let's say you got that end. Uh, I really like it, even if they sort of knocked you'll know you hit them. I really like it. I'm going to be using it on my own range and um, if enough people are interested, if you can't print them yourself, if people want to buy them, if enough people ask, I will stick some on eBay. And we have no idea how to process that yet. I'll have to work out cost of materials and time. So um, thanks for watching. I hope you like that. Um, we like recycling and uh, doing our bit for, for the environment. And uh, hope to see you again soon. Hey, we're out on the range. Yeah. Um, Daz is now going to have a pop at the... Uh, Your 3D. Printed 3D printed CO2 holders. So um, here we go. Yay! There you go. Okay. Look at that. That jumped off quite nice, isn't it? Cocked and loaded, ready to go. Not loaded. Not loaded. No. Oh, two, two for one. Once. Two at once. Look at that. Wow. Well, you... wow. Oh. 